He always led from the front. You know, Leon, he inspired subordinates, but he also inspired me. Anybody that's around Sarah Miranda, you wanted to be a better person. It, it generates a visceral response because uh, it, what this does is, is a healing process for a lot of us. But it also uh, is able to talk about and identify some of uh, uh, you know, the warriors from the state and bring them all together and then you know, name this facility after somebody who was a great uh, hero to us. Uh, with the gym being the PEC, Professional Education Center, gym na nationwide, it shows the partnership between the NGB uh, PEC folks and the Arkansas National Guard folks that we're a neighbor. They want to recognize one of our fallens and name their building. To me, it just shows a great partnership between both, both groups. It, it really uh, symbolizes Leon uh, and the fact that he was a quiet professional. And, you know, this is where individuals go to better themselves. So you couldn't ask for a better place uh, to represent a soldier who, who gave it all. It's almost like a reunion out here. They're able to see each other. It's been you know, 15 years is a blink of an eye once you look into their eyes. And so, and then the, the great showing from his family, this family that we can honor as Gold Star family members uh, for the sacrifice that they live every single day uh, by losing this loved one. And it not only, this isn't just for Troy, it's for us. Because like uh, TJ said, it's a, it's a healing process and it has been for 15 years. And I haven't seen him in 15 years, and this is awesome. So. Yeah, this is a, the first time I've seen Russ, and uh, first time I've been able to talk to uh, some of the guys that I ne never saw again after, after we left them. Getting to do this is special. Yes, it is. Just want to say uh, what an honor it is to stand here for this warrior, and I'll never forget him. Cool.